television viewing households in the Northern Cape have registered for the government-subsidized set-top boxes. Minister of Communication Faith Mutambi is revisiting Kaimos near Uppington to assess the progress of the rollout of the set-top boxes. This is part of the digital migration from analog. Our reporter, Keith Seister, joins us from Kaimos. Keith, good afternoon to you. Uh, what's the expectation for this visit from the minister and how is it going so far? A very good afternoon to you, Natasha. Minister Mutambi has just arrived here uh, to have a sort of a... a, a, a view of for herself as to how the, the progress is going with, with the installation and the use of the set-top boxes. The minister, has, as you said, last December came and rolled out the, the program. And uh, with me is the minister um, to speak and tell us a bit more how she feels about what she has actually experienced here this afternoon. A very good afternoon to you, minister. Um, this project must be very, very important to you. Yes, it is. It is. Since we are here again today, since we came in here in December, what is exciting, you see a lot of young people around here. They were sharing with me their stories now, how they can watch television, how can they see the education programs, the music and everything. And the excitement is all across all ages. Because now people are empowered in this area to be able to make decisions, access to information. They've been deprived of information since democracy. And now to them, the people of Kemos, the people of Kakamas, I like any other South African with this access to television. And now it is also multiple channel. They're able to see all the three SABC channels, the E-News channel, and also to, they have got access to 18 radio stations that belongs to the SABC. So you can see there's a big progress. I've also checked on the number of registration. Remember we launched the registration here in October. Now I've seen that about 61% of the population here, they've already registered. You can see the zeal and the passion to receive this project and then it's making a difference in their lives. So. I'm, I'm here with a lot of beneficiaries, the ward councillor, the young people that have benefited from the training, and the beneficiaries themselves that never ha have access. You'll hear from their stories that indeed this has made a difference in their life. Now, Minister, tell me, um, what's the, pro the, the process for this project um, forward? Yes, you know, 1st of February, we have started the dual illumination period meaning that set-top boxes are available in the country. So the dual illumination period is that you can still use your analog TV together with your digital television. So uh, once we have an uptake of 80%, that's when we're going to switch off. Remember in our budget speech, we have committed up to 18 to 24 months. So we are working on this, pro in, on this date to say, if everybody has got an uptake, and with the reception that we've seen here in Kemos, people are registering in numbers, We've already gone to Limpopo, people are registering in the northern, in the, in the first state they are registering. You can see the reception of the program. I think they will assist us to meet our target for switch off. Once you have 90% coverage, then you are going to switch off. What I want to do now is to urge all South Africans, wherever they are, to go and register in the post office, those that qualify, those that don't qualify, set of boxes are available in the market now. They can go and buy. We have got a lot of manufacturers here that were allocated that are manufacturing all the boxes if you can visit the retails you'll get them those that qualify then they can register at the post office then they'll get the boxes for free thank you very much uh, minister matambi for your input into um, this project and uh, input into the community of kaimus um, with that natasha it is uh, back to the studio in johannesburg Thank you very much. Uh, our reporter there, Keith uh, Sayer, from, uh, uh, live from Kamos in the Northern Cape with the Communications Minister Faith Mutambi. Well, Zimbabwe